evening. Hi, good evening, everyone. Hey, good evening, guys. Hello. Hello, Gracia. What's up? All good? Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Nice to see you, Gracia. What do you do today, Gracia? Did you have something to eat yet? Yes, I already ate the dinner. <laughs> you already ate? Okay, you already had dinner. Repeat, mm -hmm. I already had dinner. I already had dinner. I have already. Okay, all right. Dinner. Or have I? I have already eaten dinner, right? Good job. All right, good I job, guys. Eaten. All right, very good, very good. I am glad to see you here. Thank you for being early. And I'm sorry to interrupt you, Gracia. I know I, I didn't know that you were speaking. Um, so thank you for being here, uh, Daniela Aquino. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you, teacher. All right. I'm glad to have you here, uh, Daniel. Something fun that you need to, that you did today? Something interesting? Uh, just work with a lot of trouble, but we are uh, resolving that. <laughs> okay, all right, but you are solving that? Okay, good job, good job, good job, okay. All right, man, um, I'm glad that you're here. And uh, David, David here on, how are you, man? Hi. Super good, thanks for asking. Okay, how was how was your day? Are you tired? Are you okay? Everything's okay, but this was pretty hot. <laughs> it was pretty hot. Yeah, man, it's hot. Yes. Where, where do you live? Uh, you don't live Ilopango? in South, South, Ilopango. Yes. All right, all right. All right. Uh, okay, that's that's good, man. Ilopango, la ciudad más segura del Salvador. Okay, good job. <laughs> the safest city in El Salvador, right? Good job. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Francisco, how are you, man? Hey, fine, man. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm feeling a little better today because I got sick, you know, like a month ago. And then they told me that it was, it might have been COVID, but then I recovered and then I got the after effects. I don't know, man. I'm not. I'm you not, got COVID? Uh, I don't know. They told me that I, I was a suspect. But oh, uh, wait. I, I was 28 days in the hospital, man, for the same shit. Sorry, man. Jesus Christ, don't worry, man. I talk like that. Don't don't worry. <laughs> hey, dude, days, man. dude, I oh my God. But was was it when you were like I remember one one day that you got pretty sick. Is that is that yes. is, is, oh that's what you got? Oh yeah, man. that's what I got. Dude, that's heavy. All right. So I'll tell and you I'll, I'll, right I'll, now, I'll, I'll I'll tell you later what I what the the um, I'll tell you what I what I had the symptoms that I that I got later, 
Um, yeah, we can share, on, man. On, on WhatsApp, because I want to know, man. Because of the time, I can't share that with you here. But but that would be great yeah, to no. know, man. All right. Uh, thank you for coming. Thank you for coming, Arturo, man, my man. What's up? All good? I'm good. I'm great, teacher. What about you? It's all going good, man. All right. Nice to see you. Uh, right, Rocio you Cepeda. Hello, Rocio. How are you? I'm fine. Great. All going good. All right. Uh, Barbara. Hello, Barbara. Hi. How are you? All good. Okay. All right. I'd like to see you in space. Thank All you. Right. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Luis Cáceres. How are you doing? All right. Say hi to March for me, okay? And Bart. Say hi to March and Bart for me, all right? Bart Simpson? Bart Simpson. <laughs> oh, is that from The Simpsons or from, from another TV show? Simpsons, okay. Carlos Laines, welcome, Carlos. Hello. Nice to see you, Carlos. All good, man. How about you? Everything okay. Everything good? All right. Nice to see you, yes. man. Karina Castellanos, how are you? Good? Hello, David. I'm okay. How are All you? All right. I'm good. Thank you for asking. How are you, Alejandra? Yes. I am good, thank you. All right, nice to see you here, Fatima. Nice to see you. How are you? Hi, teacher. All good. What about you? I'm great. Excellent. Um, thank you for asking. What about you? Um, let's see. I lost the names. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Guys, welcome everybody. Okay, it's a lot of people, but thank you very much for being here. Victoria, how are you, Victoria? Fine, thank you. You're good? You feeling okay? Yes, yes. All right, you remind me of thank someone you. I know. I, I don't know who, but you remind me of someone. Uh, really? Jose, yeah. Uh, Jose Rodriguez, how are you? Hi, David. I'm fine. Thank you for asking me. Okay, I'm fine, not I'm, I'm fine. fine, right? Fine. I'm fine. Jennifer, hello, Jennifer. How are you, Jennifer? Hello, I'm fine. All right, Enrique, welcome. All right, Douglas, Francisco, Gerardo, Jennifer, Deras, everybody, welcome, guys, okay? I would like to say hi to everyone, but it's a lot of people now, guys. All right, but thank you, guys. Thank you for calling. Thank, thank you for coming. I'm sorry, right? All right, guys, so we're going to continue with the null clauses. Guys, what the hell is a null clause? If you know, guys, explain it. Does anybody know? Can somebody explain? All right, guys, a noun clause, a noun, guys. I'm, I'm sorry, not a noun clause. A noun clause, guys. First of all, what is a noun? What is a noun? Subject. All right, it's a subject, okay? It's the subject or the object of a sentence, right? Okay, so far so good? Yeah. Yes. All right. Yes. Yeah, sure. Now, guys, so give me an example. Give me an example of a noun. Give me an example. Give me an example a of a noun. Policeman. A what? policeman. Policeman. Okay. okay, a policeman. Okay, it could be a policeman. All right, what else? He, what? My he, home. She. He, okay, he, she, uh-huh. My home. My home. My homie, right? No, whatever, guys. Okay, it could be whatever. Like, like, es, es un sujeto, right? Got it? So far, it's good? Got it. Got it, man. All yeah. right. But a noun clause, guys, okay? How can you identify the noun clause? I'm sorry about yesterday because the highlighted words from yesterday, guys, I don't think that they were noun clauses. Uh, but a noun clause, guys, is a clause. It's basically, guys, a noun that is made up. All right? Let me write down here, okay? So write this down in your notebooks, okay? So it's, it's a noun that is made up of multiple words, okay? All right? So, es un, es un noun, guys, que está hecho, que está compuesto, compuesto de bastantes palabras, okay? It's okay. a dependable, right? Clause, okay? All right, why, guys? So, básicamente, guys, es una oración que no tiene sentido si la decís por ella sola, got it? So it's basically an a example. Sentence. It's a sentence. Uh, I'll give you an, I will give you an example right now. Hold on. So it's a sentence, guys. Hold on. Let me let me mute my chat, guys. Hold on. All right. Hold on. So it's a sentence, guys, that doesn't make sense on its own. Okay. So, prácticamente, guys, 
uh, it would be something like this. All your horses, okay? <laughs> Right. The so guys, if I say, if I say, um, made her friends cry, if I only, if you only see a sentence like this, guys, pretend that this is a sentence, okay? Does this make sense, guys? Does this make sense on its own? No. No. No, right? Because this, uh -huh. because because we don't we don't know who are we talking about or who are we describing. Exactly. Oh my God. Applause, guys. Beautiful, beautiful job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Exactly, guys. So that's why something like this, guys, wouldn't work, wouldn't work on its own. Okay. Because we're not talking, we're not, we're not talking about any subject or any object, guys. We don't know the subject. We don't, we don't know what we're talking about. Okay. So we need something else. What do we need? We need the rest of the okay. sentence. Okay. All right. We need the rest of the sentence. Okay. So, so the verb, the, the actual, the actual sentence is what Alicia said, repeat guys, what Alicia said, what, what Alicia said, said, made her friends cry, made, made her, her friends, friends cry. cry, okay, all right guys, now does it make sense on its own, yes or not, yes, yes, okay. yes, who are we talking about, Alicia, all right, we're talking about Alicia, right, now teacher, how can, how can I identify uh, how can I identify noun clauses? Well, guys, you can identify them by the following words. You can identify them after that, who, that, we, what who, else? Which? What else? What sometimes? What else? Whom? Where? Whom? Okay. What else? Who's? Hey, whom is, is wrong spelling, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. So... Or who's, all right? What else? All right. Whatever. No, not the Which. word whatever, but okay. No, not, not when. exactly. When, okay. All right, you can, all right. So you can identify them with this, with these words, okay? So now take a look at the example and help me read, Daniela Aquino. Help me read the first example. Uh, an advantage of having an older brother is that you always have someone to help you. All right, now let's work on that intonation. But now, guys, notice something. What is what is the what is the what is the noun clause here, guys? You always have some someone to help you. What? You always have someone. You always have someone to help you. To help you, okay? All right, but remember, the clause, guys. The noun clause after B is optional, okay? All right, uh, the word that, guys, this right here is optional. So that's why it's in, um, it's put in parentheses. Exactly, right? So you can say, everybody repeat. Uh, the best thing about having brothers and sisters. The best thing about having brothers and sisters. sisters is you're never late. Is you're never, never, never late. late. Hey. Okay, all right, guys. So you can say is that you're never late or you can say is you're never late, okay? All right, where, where do you see the verb to be here, guys? Is. Is, okay, that's why it's called a non-clause after be, okay? All right, the reason why, guys, is that it contains the verb, the verb be, okay? All right, so guys, now give me an example, guys. Just think about this, okay? Give me an example of the clause thinking about a reason, okay? Imagínese el motivo de algo y me dan la, la, la causa y el motivo de algo, okay? This is, this is the cause, guys. The clause is the cause of the first sentence, okay? Now. I, I, didn't, I didn't finish college because I didn't have money. Okay. Let's change that, okay? Let's, let's do it differently, okay? So remember, a problem guys, with politics. Uh -huh. A problem with politics is that exactly all they, is that all they going to make her make them uh, taking advantage of the government okay hold on a problem with politics is that uh, they they get advantage of the government all right they take advantage they take advantage yeah, they take okay. advantage 
of, of the, government. the government, okay? Good job, right? Good job. Very good job, uh, Francisco. Applause for Francisco, guys. Good, good, good job, okay? All right, all right? So, guys, take a look at the example, okay? Uh, the example is talking about a problem, all right? Uh, or an advantage or one, one cause, guys. One cause and an effect. One effect to cause, okay? So, where is, where is the noun clause here, here guys? On the, on, um, Francisco Sanders. Where do you that see they, they take the advantage of the government. Good job. Applause, guys. Very good job. Very good job, okay? All right. They take advantage of the government, okay? And where is the verb, to, where is the verb be here? Is. is. All right. Is. Is, okay? Now, can I say, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry to raise that. Uh, can I say, guys, uh, a problem with politics is they take advantage of the government. Can I say that? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. guys. I can say that. Oh, my God. You guys are good. Good. Good job. Right. Now, do me a favor, guys. Everybody, I'm going to keep explaining, but I need everybody to start sending me an example. Okay? Si quieren poner right. más frases, guys, háblenme de, de la ventaja de algo, guys. Okay? Una ventaja de salir contigo, right, es que... I don't know, que, que me puedo comprar muchas cosas, right? I don't know. An advantage <laughs> of going out with you is that I can buy a lot of things, right? So, an example like that, okay? Una ventaja o un problema, all right? Let's go, let's all go. Right. Everybody send in your answers in the chat right now. Let's go, okay? Meanwhile, Francisco, pick someone. Uh, Gracias, Rivera. Gracias, Rivera. Let's go, Gracias, Rivera. Okay. Give me um... an example, okay? An advantage of working in World Vision is that I have help children always. Okay, on work vision or in work vision? In? On. In. Uh, or at. 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 Okay, an advantage at. of working at work vision. Uh-huh. Is that I have help children. Uh -huh. Every time. Every time, okay? Now, guys, porque esto es una cláusula, guys. All right, if I say I help children every time, porque, all right, si ustedes dicen esta cláusula, guys, if you, if you talk about this clause, guys, does it make sense on its own? Do we know the context? Yes or not? We don't know the context. We don't know the context, right? So that's why. That's why it becomes a clause, okay? So an advantage of working at work vision is that I can help ch help children children every time. Gracias. Where is uh where do you see the 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 noun the noun clause here? Um I help children every time. I help children every time. Can I say an advantage of working at work vision is that is I can help children every time? Can I say that? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, you can, right? I can. That is optional. Sounds better the other way, but I think I, that I can. Good job. Applause for Gracia, guys. Good job, Gracia. Good job, right? Gracia, pick someone else. Go. Okay. Someone who has see. not participated. Luis Cáceres. Luis Cáceres. Let's go. Give me another, uh, give me a problem, okay? Let's talk about a problem now. Luis Cáceres? Hi. Uh... A problem. Hmm. Not pretty sure. Uh, what kind a of problem example? with my friend? A problem with my job? A problem with my wife? A problem with my kids? Uh, <laughs> a problem with La Toxica right now? Huh? <laughs> I don't know if you have a, I'm not pretty sure. A uh, problem. Uh, how, how to use a noun clause with a problem? Um, yeah, mm. it's just giving an opinion, man. Or right? it's just your opinion about something. A uh, problem with uh, Nayib Bukele is that, or right? Whatever, man. Whatever you want to say. Okay? Clown. Uh, I can't hear you. I'm sorry. Oh. Could you please speak up? Because I can I can barely hear you. What about now? No. Not yet. Problem with you. Let me grab uh, some help. Uh, hey, I problem with my microphone is that I can't hear shit, right? All right, good job. Please. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right. Um, <laughs> let's see. Karina Castellanos. Let's go. Give me one, all right? I'll let you um, fix your microphone, man, all right? Hello. Uh, an advantage to live in Santa Tecla is that oh, all deliveries December. come to my home. Okay, an, an advantage of to live. Oh, an living. advantage to live in an Santa Tecla. An advantage to live. Are you sure, guys? Oh, oh living. An oh, advantage no. of living. An advantage to living. No, to in live Santa in Santa Tecla. Everybody, an advantage of living in Santa Tecla. Of living in Santa Tecla is that all deliveries come to my house. All deliveries, okay, all deliveries come to my house. Good job. Applause, guys. Good, good, good job, okay? All right. Tell me, identify the non clause here. All, del all deliveries come to my house. Good job, right? All deliveries come to my house. Can I say... Can I say an advantage of living in Santa Tecla is all deliveries come to my house? Yes, of course. Yes. All right. Very good job. Very good job. Okay. All right. Let's let's just work on that preposition, okay? Because it's of living, okay? All right. Last example, guys, from you, Victoria Hernandez. Let's go. Give me one. All right, but don't use an advantage. Um, let's use a problem. All right, a problem. A problem with being at home is that you can eat. Anytime you want. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Applause, guys. <laughs> all, right, all right, all right. Hey, good job. Probably with being at home is that you can either. All right, so what is the noun clause, uh, Victoria? Uh, eat. You can eat anytime you want. Okay, you can eat anytime you want, right? Can I say this? Is this correct? Yes. 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 That's All right. Correct. Yes, guys. Okay. All right. Verb to be over here, right? Yes. Okay. Now, guys, why is this a clause, guys? It's because if I say you can eat anytime you want, guys, I don't know the context of this. Doesn't make any sense. Exactly. Right, if you, and if you say a problem of being at home is, si vos solo decís esto, guys, does it make a, does it make sense to you? If you only no. say this, right? No, it, it it won't make sense to you, right? All right, guys. Do you have a question? Do you have a question? No. All right, I'll check your examples, okay? All right. Uh, let's see, Francisco. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, let's do something, guys. I will check your examples while we do the rest of the exercises online, okay? Got it? Okay. Got right, it. That's what I'll do. So, so because we gotta move on with the class, guys. Okay. Hold on. All right, guys. So no more questions. Then let's move on. All right, guys. So this is what I was explaining, guys. The noun clause, guys, is all of this, okay? All right. What, all right according to what I said, guys, okay? I, I remember that you took notes. Thomas Machado. Yes. According to the definition that I gave you at the beginning, what is the meaning of a noun, of a noun clause? Uh. You, didn't, you don't have it, right? Uh, no. No, you don't have it, do you? Okay, who has it, guys? Who has the definition? The definition that I gave you at the beginning noun of the plus. class. It's a noun made of multiple words. Good job, okay. It's a noun made up of, uh, actually made multiple out of, plus. sorry, made out multiple of word. multiple Words, guys, okay? Don't say made up. Made out of multiple words, okay? Because made up is like como que vos alimentas, okay? Made out of multiple right. words, guys, okay? All right. All right. That, that doesn't make sense at this, okay? On its own, okay? Que no tiene sentido por ella sola. Por ella misma. All right. Exactly, guys, okay? Depends All right, guys. So we see another one. Exactly. So we see one example here, which is the first one that we got at the beginning. All right. Hold on. Why is this thing moving my presentation? <laughs> okay, guys. So now, guys, the only thing that's remaining, guys, it's examples, okay? So we're going to go back to the platform. I need everybody to go to the exercise 1.8, okay? Eight. Let's go to exercise 1.8, guys, okay? All right. All right. So while you're doing that, guys, 
I'm gonna give you five minutes. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm gonna check your answers, all right? All right. Okay. So let's go. All right, Jose, Rodriguez, Alejandra, Barbara, let's join the rooms, guys. Okay. Yeah. Hey, I, I have the same problem, David. What uh, happened? I'm not, uh, I, don't, I don't have access yet to the platform. Did you send a message to the tech support number that you yes. got in the chat room? I, yes, I talked to Jonathan Navas. Uh, they sent me the the email to start the classes and they say uh, if they have sent me the the link or they say uh, they told me about the uh, when the class starts and i say yes i have the email so it uh, doesn't uh, didn't answer okay work with him for 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 a bit okay uh send them an email again so they can be aware okay Okay. I, okay. I, I can't. I, I can't do it. myself. I can't do anything about it. But yeah, but, no, uh, If they don't answer you tomorrow, then I'll, I'll I'll be on top of it. Okay. Send me a message. Just okay. So okay. You know, okay. All right. But thank you for letting me okay. know, man, and thank you for coming. Okay. Hey, I, I didn't know that you got COVID, man. I thought that it was something yeah. else. No, I I was uh, very sick, man. Almost died, but I'm here, safe and sound. Sounds good, man. Hey, um, mm -hmm. I'll I'll tell you what I felt later, right? So you, yeah, sure, no problem. You, you let me know if, if it was kind of like the same to you, okay? Okay. All right. All right, let's work together, okay? Share the screen if you can, uh, Gerardo, all right? They say he's going to send me in the chat. Okay. Uh, let's see an example, an event. Uh, okay, a trouble, a trouble of having a younger sister is that she borrowed my cloth. If that she, check, she takes my cloth, a uh, trouble of having a young sister, a young sister is that she always borrow my cloth. We'll see. Well, the second one, let's try. Okay. I have a younger sister, the trouble is she, I'm going to read it. To borrow my, my clothes. Mm -hmm. Clothes, uh -huh. okay. The third one, I'm away at college, the bad part is that I'm- Later mm -hmm. we'll, later later. We'll, we'll cook correct it. Okay, I'm I, away at college. Uh -huh. The bad part is that I miss my family. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So what is this? The bad part. Yeah, the bad part. Oh. Mm. Being away at college. You good, guys? No questions? It's, um, for me, it's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you have Victoria next to you. 
Yes, um, we can, we, we couldn't do right. Share, share, share your, could, the you, number. could you please share your, um, your, your, your screen with me, Victoria? Uh, I, I am in the, in the cell phone. Okay, hold on, I'll share it with but you. I can, but I can read it. The sure. nice thing of, of number one. Mm -hmm. The nice thing of being the youngest in the family is that I, is that I get a lot of attention. Okay. But, I that's I that's can, okay. Mm -hmm. So the the nice thing is I get a lot of attention, okay? I'm the youngest one in the family. Okay, mm -hmm. so the night you saying the nice thing of being the youngest one of the family is that I get a lot of attention, right? Attention. Yes. Yes. Of being the youngest one yes. or the youngest, okay, the youngest in the family. Mm -hmm is that I get a lot of attention, right? Now, to tell you to tell you what, this is 100% correct, okay? Esto no está nada mal, okay? But okay. this exercise requires something something specifically. So let's try to put it in a different way. What else what else can you combine this into? Oh, All right, first of all, let's let's take a look at something, okay? So you got mm -hmm. the nice thing is I get a lot of attention, okay? All right, so there is yes. the nice thing is I get a lot of attention. So there is the verb to be here. All right. Mm -hmm. But you can say the nice the nice thing is um hold on, let me try to change it in the a right different way. Thing. Yeah, this seems like a hundred percent correct. What's wrong? Let's see. Do you have do you have the number two and three and four correct? No. Have, no. None of them? No, no one. No. None of them? None of them. All right, give me one second. I gotta stop sharing the screen. Can you send me a screenshot of the answers that you have? Of the answer that you have? Uh, I don't, I I don't only... All right, I'll say I'll I'll send you something, okay? The answer is this, okay. but I don't, th that is, the answer is absolutely perfect. So I don't know what's wrong. I honestly don't know what's wrong because the answer is uh -huh. correct. Yes, hold on. Uh -huh. uh, uh, that's why we were discussing. Maybe if, uh, if we don't use uh, that, okay, let's not use that, yeah. okay? Let's, let's put it without that, let's see. So I'm gonna show you how I put it here, okay? Lo, te voy a mostrar como lo puse yo. All right, so the nice thing about being about. the yeah. youngest yeah. in the family is that I get a lot of attention. That's what I put in here. Okay, about. so let's see. The, the nice thing about. All right, so that is what, correct. The nice see? thing about being. Yeah, the nice, yeah, mm. but that's, that's not the problem, right? Que le pusimos diferente? Oh, is the, uh, I think wow, that you were using, no, I think that you were using you, is that you get a lot of attention. See, this is incorrect, it's no. I get a lot of attention, got it? See, si. yes, right. yes. Good job, right? Yeah. So continue with the rest, yes. just pay attention to the pronouns, okay? Presten atención a los pronombres, right? Okay, thank right, you. Good job, good job, good job. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> trying to do it, man, but all I run. It's okay. You're no, bad. You're, you're not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. It's young Ari que no está mal a su respuesta, guys. It's just, it's a very small thing. How are you guys? Hello, Dalila. Nice to see you again. Hi, how are you? What are I'm you good. doing right now? <laughs> We're answering the exercise 1.8 from the okay. platform, okay? All right, Alejandra, how are you doing? Did you? It, a lot of people are having issues with this case, but that doesn't mean it's incorrect. Okay, I'll teach you why it's incorrect. Okay, I've been trying to wonder why. I know I'm. I'm it might not be perfect, but but zero out of five is, sounds illogic. All right, no, but uh, believe me, you guys are are doing good. 
the thing is that this, the, the platform, it's, it's just, there is a mistake, but you're not noticing that mistake because it's very confusing. I will explain it, but listen to what I'm gonna say right now. Pay attention to the pronoun, okay? That is the mistake that everybody's making. Pay attention to the subject of the sentence. Pay attention to the pronoun, okay? Meaning it might not be you, it might be I. Got it? All right, pay attention to those pronouns, guys, okay? Because that's where the mistake is. How are you doing, guys? Having issues? Yes. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little bit difficult. Yes, it yeah. is. Good. No, it's not. No, guys, it's not that. You have the right answer. I saw you and you guys understood. Okay, so that's that's good. Now, the problem, guys, is that you are not taking, you're not paying attention to the pronouns. Pay attention to the pronouns. And also the periods, guys, okay? Okay. Okay, pay, okay. Atten pay attention to the pronouns okay. and the periods, okay? Okay. Perfect. So we will try. The pronouns, guys, maybe it might not be you. It might be I, okay? Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. Okay, let me see. <laughs> you know, I, I call the trouble this. of having <laughs> a younger sister is that. Did you back to the number two? I was just reviewing the second one based on the notes. <laughs> so I could see if I can change something. Because in the second one, I put the trouble of having a, a younger sister is that she always wants to borrow my clothes. Continue, you're doing good. Okay. I, I, I reviewed your answers in the chat room and you guys are doing good. Okay. Okay, okay. we'll keep trying. <laughs> I know, don't worry. <laughs> and the third one, the bar part of being away is that I miss my family. Is that part that I miss my family? Did you try it that way? Being. Um, Fatima, what's going on? Hello, how are you? What's up, what's up? What can I do for you? We have problems with the, with the answers because, uh, for example, in the first one, we tried uh, the nice thing of being the youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention and it's incorrect. Why? Okay. All right. What was, it, what was the answer? I'm sorry. Uh, we try the nice thing of being the youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention. All right. The nice thing. Hmm, the nice thing of being. Mm, yes. All right. Check that preposition. Okay. Okay. The preposition. Do you know what the purpose, what preposition I'm talking about? The mm. the the clause the the structure is perfect, man. The structure okay. perfect, okay. But you have a mistake with the preposition on the first one, okay? All right. How are you doing, guys? We are doing everything wrong. <laughs> what is the answer that you got on the first one? Uh, the first one, the nice thing of being the youngest in the family is that I get a lot of attention. Okay, preposition, man. All right, there is a mistake with the preposition on the, on the first one, okay? All right, uh, and what do, what do you have on number two? Number no. two. Mm -hmm. Continue. continue. Uh -huh. What do you have in number two? The trouble of, of having a, a younger sister is she always wants to borrow my clothes. Beautiful job. Beautiful, beautiful job on both answers. Both are correct, except for prepositions. The prepositions are wrong. Uh, number three, what do you got on number three? Preposition. Number three? Yeah. The bad part of being away at college is that I miss my family. The bad part of being away, of being away. At college. 
Of being away at college. Of being away at sure. college. All right. Does that so. does doesn't that sound redundant to you? That you have to mention college. All right. Number four. Well, number four. Yes. The worst thing, the worst thing of working at night. Working at night is I can't have dinner with my family. Beautiful job with the structure. You're you're making a mistake with the preposition. All right. Number five. Number five. One bad thing of being the oldest in the family is I always have to babysit. Preposition. All right. Don't worry, everything is good except the preposition. What, what preposition can you use instead of of? Mm. One bad thing, to be. No, preposition, man, preposition. Remember, preposition in, on, of, about, with. So what can you what can you use? In. In. In being. No 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 no. Ah. Uh -uh. All right. Check the examples from the. All right. Go back. All right. In the um. I'll I'll show the presentation. We're gonna go back right now. Okay. Hold All on. right. We're go back. All right, guys. Uh, welcome back. Welcome, 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 welcome back. What is that, teacher? All right, guys. So thank you, guys. Thank you, guys, for trying your best. Now, I saw some of you guys. Very good job. You understood the clause, guys, the non clause. Now, I saw some of you having very, very, very small mistakes, guys, okay? Mm -hmm. So do, remember the example that we showed, um, that we showed before. All right, the example that, that, um, the example that I gave you guys is this right here, okay? So now guys, when you say the best thing, this right here, what preposition do you see here, guys? About. about. All right, about. the best thing about, okay? It's not the best thing of having, the best thing about having, all right? What preposition do you see here? With. With, with okay, with. The, pre the problem with, okay? The what preposition thing. do you see here? Oh. Oh. oh, okay. Now, teacher, can I say an advantage? An advantage about having an older brother? Can I say that? Uh, yeah, you can. <laughs> yes, it is understandable, guys. But you, you just use off, guys. Okay, the preposition is off. After advantage, guys, just say off. Okay. All right. Now, Let's um, thank you. So the platform, guys, is accepting the answer. It's accepting both answers, without that or with that, okay? So all the answers that I saw, guys, almost all the answer, 80% of the answers, were following the right structure of this, okay? Beautiful, beautiful job with that. The biggest problem, guys, was these prepositions that we saw in the examples, okay? In the beginning. Okay. All right, so try to correct those prepositions. And also, guys, the other mistake that I saw, the period, guys, okay? Do not forget the period at the end. Do not forget uppercase, okay? All right. So correct that, guys, and tell me if it works for you. Okay. Did it work? Did anybody get it, get a, a better score now? Yes, I did in the second one. Okay, you did in the second one. Good job. Good job, good job, right? Another one? I have problems with the number three because I try with all of the uh, off with not. <laughs> all right, guys. So I'm gonna show you. So you only have number problems with number three, or in it, so you got four out of five. You got four out of five. Right. All right. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay. Who else got all of them or four out of five, guys? How many did you get? Um, how many did you get, Dalila? All right, uh, I, huh? There's one. One, okay, Victoria, how many did you get now that, that we're talking about the prepositions? 
How many? Mm -hmm. None. None? None, none, none? No. Okay, right. Me neither. So whoever whoever yeah, didn't get anything, guys, Victoria, read your first you read your first uh, answer. The nice thing about being the youngest in the family is that you get a lot of attention. Okay, so the nice thing about being the youngest in the family is that you get a lot of attention, okay? So guys, this is perfect, okay? Perfect, perfect, okay? The clause is here. See, is you get a lot of attention. This is the clause, okay? All right, so let's see, let's, let's see what I got. The nice thing about being the youngest in that, in that family is that I get a lot of attention. Oh, that's another thing. I told you guys, pay attention, guys. Presting attention, guys, as al, al pronoun, okay? That's why I told you, pay attention to the pronoun, right? Is that the I, bite. not that you guys, that I get a lot of attention. Got it? All right, try now, but beautiful job, okay? Everything else was good. What do you have in number two? So who else did not get number two right, guys? <laughs> try to solve it now. Presting attention al pronoun, guys, okay? Let's pay attention to the pronoun. All right, I, I see si pueden callar ahí Fear Lies. Thank you. <laughs> Fear Lies. Just mess yourself. <laughs> right. No. Lies con todo ahí, right? All right. Good job, guys. So, uh, number two. Who else did okay. not get number two, guys? Me. Who's me? <laughs> Thomas. <laughs> Thomas, okay. What, what answer do you have? Uh, I already changed it. <laughs> <laughs> so you have it okay who the who does the not have trouble. number two correct guys the trouble, trouble uh, Fatima is... number two me teacher number two is it correct Fatima number two um, no and I delete the answer uh, so is it correct now or is um, it still incorrect is it still incorrect uh, yes I don't have an answer for that. All right, give me your answer. Give me your answer. <laughs> well, I was trying with the troll about mañana. Guys, do about me a favor. Hold on, hold on. All right, mute yourselves, guys. All right, Fatima. All right, I'll mute yourself, Fatima. All right, let's go. Well, I was trying with the with trouble of being the younger sister. sister is that you uh she always wants to borrow my clothes so okay the trouble of guys if the trouble with right the trouble with being the youngest sister is that i what is that she uh, she wants, wants to, to borrow, borrow my clothes my clothes okay all right let's see if that works the trouble with having a younger sister. So pay attention to that. It says, I have a younger sister, okay? The trouble is she always wants to borrow my clothes. If you, and you said the trouble with being the younger sister. Okay, Fatima, lo que pasó en tu caso fue que no le, no le comprendiste. You did not understood. I mean, you did not understand the, um, you did not understand the, the, the context, okay? Yeah. All right. It's not who is the younger sister? Are you the younger sister or do you have a younger sister? Uh, yes, I have a younger sister. Okay. You're not the younger sister. And you were saying that you were the younger sister, okay? So that's why this was wrong, okay? So the answer is this, guys. Okay, the answer is the trouble with having a younger sister is that she always wants to borrow my clothes, okay? Okay. All right, number three. Who has number three correct? Me, teacher. Someone who has it correct. Uh, you're muted, guys. You have to unmute yourself, okay? I, I, I don't have him right, but uh, can I tell you how I wrote and maybe you can? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Go. Okay. Um... The bad part, the bad, the bad part of being away at college is that I miss my family. 
the bad part of being away at college is that I miss my family. Okay, guys, the sentence says, what does the sentence, Carlos, help me read the sentence. Number three. Um, hey. the number three, number three, sentence number three. I'm away at college. The bad part is that I miss my family. Okay, guys, so the problem here, guys, is that you're being redundant, okay? I'm away. The bad part of being away is that I miss my family. That is the answer, okay? All right? There is no okay. need to say that you're at college. But I understand, guys, that is a little bit confusing. This one was a little bit confusing, okay? All right, yeah. number four. Who has it right, guys? Who has it right? Me, Dalila. Dalila, number four. The worst, worst thing about working at night is that I can't have dinner with my family. Okay, the worst thing about what? About working at night mm -hmm. is that I can't have dinner with my family. Have dinner, <laughs> right, with my family. Good mm -hmm. job. Good job, applause for Dalila, guys. Beautiful job, beautiful, beautiful job, okay? Good job. Number five, who has number five, uh, five correct? Me, David. Go. Uh, one bad thing about being the, the oldest in the family <laughs> is that uh, I always have to babysit. Have to baby, to babysit, right? Good job, applause, guys. Good, good, good job, okay? So, guys, it was just a matter of, of prepositions and paying attention to the to the pronouns, okay? <laughs> Beautiful job. Everybody got a 10? Yes? Yeah. All right, yeah. I need everybody with 100 right now, okay? All right. So let me know if you did not. If you did not get 100, let me know. Yes, I got 100. You got 100? I got 100. Yep, I, got got uh, All I right. have the number three wrong. Number three is wrong, okay? I'm just going to send it to the chat room, okay? <laughs> about, about part of being, I don't know why. Okay. All right, I'm going to send number three to the chat room. Anybody else? And the number oh. two, please. <laughs> number two, okay, there. Mm. All right, good number job, guys. Five. Number what? All number of them? Five. <laughs> you were saying I, 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 I show <laughs> I was showing you the answers guys what the hell alright it's okay man <laughs> so number one there you go number two number three oh my god alright number, number three, four and number five number four and number five Love them. <laughs> All right, guys. So as soon as as soon as I I spotted somebody, everybody else came came out too. You know, <laughs> everybody else came out with no. I, I, I it's not it's not correct either. You know. All right, guys. Very good job. Very good job. Do you have a question, guys, regarding noun clauses? Marina, do you have a question? I do. No, no, no. Uh, Dalila, yes. Tell me. How can I a real? Not realize, but how can identify when use when I can use, um, for example, travel with and no travel of having, for example. The travel with, it's just. Do you know what a? Do you know a, Do you know what a phrasal? Um, verbs. No, 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 not phrasal verbs. Okay, what's this called? I forgot. All right, but combine <laughs> every time. Every time, no, guys. There is something else. Um, a prepositional phrase is. Do you know what a prepositional phrase is? Dalila? No. Okay. A prepositional phrase is bullshit. Now, a prepositional phrase, guys, is a, it's a phrase that is like that just because it has to be like that, okay? Así tiene que ser porque así tiene que ser, right? So, problem with... I have to memorize. Yes. Like That's this it. word okay. becomes one thing, okay? Uh, no. Just Google prepositional phrases on Google and you'll understand what I mean, okay? It's just okay. phrases that you have to learn, okay? All right, guys. Very good job. Very good job, okay? All right, guys. So, uh, that's it, guys. We're going to we're gonna finish the platform on Monday, guys. Tomorrow, guys, remember, 
tomorrow, I let me ask something, guys, because we started on, on Tuesday, but, you know, classes are over on, on Thursdays, right? So tomorrow, guys, we are not going to have a class, okay? What? Uh, repeat, guys, we're not going to have a class. I want to make sure that everybody... We're not going to have a class. We're not going to have a class. All right, we're, we're going to have a class until Monday. We're on vacation. Really? No, it's a, no, it's not yeah. that. <laughs> yes, yes, but not tomorrow. No, being... no, it's because, guys, classes are from Monday to Thursday. From Monday when to when? Thursday. Monday to Thursday. Monday uh, to Thursday. Thursday. Yes, guys, okay? Entonces, de lunes a jueves. That's when we have, you know, that's when you have your, your, your class available. All right, guys, so yes. uh, I have another class incoming right now, guys. As always, guys, it's been really nice to see you. All right. Um, the video will be uploaded today, guys. You have the link from the video, guys. And if you need anything, guys, hit me up on WhatsApp. I'm going to answer you like in three hours or four because I have other classes. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, guys, okay? I'm honest, okay? I'm sincere. All right, no, it's true, guys. It's just because I'm always working. So, uh, but if you need anything, guys, just, you know, if it's urgent, just say, hey, the teacher, it's urgent, it's urgent you know? Uh, thank you guys for letting me know if you were, that you were going to come in late for whoever, you know, for people who, who came, came over late today. Aside from that, guys, it's been nice seeing you today. So I'll see you on Monday. Have a nice weekend, guys. Enjoy. Thank you, guys. Same to you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Thank you. Bye, Bye, everybody. Bye, -bye. See you on Monday. Bye. See you. Bye, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you.